Hi guys, Jennifer here. Welcome back to my channel. I wanted to share an entry that I received for my giveaway, the lifting up a friend giveaway. If you haven't seen that video with the details, please check below. Um, I will leave the link to the other video. I have extended the date. Originally it was going to be May 31st, but I realize there's a lot of overseas packages coming and a lot of people hadn't seen the initial video and so i want to give everybody the opportunity to enter if they desire so i'm extending it by one month so june 30th will be the deadline this particular box was more of a gift and it was from Esme, and Esme owns crafty me shop she didn't want to be entered but she wanted to provide Violet with a beautiful embellishment box. So this is an amazing embellishment box, you guys. And I don't expect you to send something like this. Um, this is almost 12 inches long by almost eight inches. So do not feel like this is what you need to send. Esme is just very generous and um, she really wanted to send a beautiful gift to Violet. So I want to share that. She used Tilda Papers. If you haven't heard of Tilda Papers, it is a company that used to, that creates fabrics and they used to create scrapbook papers and they were super shabby chic and um, they're just really gorgeous. So Let's go ahead and open this. This is a um, wood wooden box. And so over here we have some beautiful flowers. Really pretty ribbon flowers. These are so pretty. Wow. So remember that, you know, Esme owns a store, so she has access to things like amazing things. I just want to show you all of the little goodies in here. Uh-oh, one went flying. So there's a rolled silky rose. Oh, these are so cute. Oh, I hope you're seeing this. I hope I'm in frame here. Look at these little appliques. Little pink and purple flowers here and these pretty pink ones with the pearl so lots of goodies in this little compartment right here Put that one like that okay and then there's some beautiful millinery flowers in here aren't these gorgeous Oh, I just love millinery flowers. Aren't these so pretty? These are so dainty. Beautiful as may. Love it. And then in here, there's some ribbons. Oh, with some metal. Oh my gosh, look at that gorgeous ribbon. That is so pretty and it's so soft. And look at these, these look like some vintage um, metal pieces. So cool. Look at the little baby cherub. And some buttons. Maybe they came out of this one. Super pretty. And she wrapped them so nicely in this gorgeous trim. Okay. And in here, there's like... It's filled with these amazing buttons. All kinds of different gorgeous buttons. 
Oh, I see like a little mother of pearl button. Oopsie. All kinds of fun buttons for your projects. And then over here I have some trims. How pretty that pink fabric is. I mean, ribbon. And then this gorgeous, like, sparkly, peachy color. And then this one has like some very pale purpley flowers. Oh, look how cute. That is such a cute trim. Love it. Look how adorable. Oh my gosh, those are so unique. And then this one. like a little scalloped trim. Gorgeous. So cute, Esme. How fun. She wrapped them with seam binding. That's a good idea. All right. Where should we go to next? Let's look over here. All these pretty little applique bits. So cute. Oh, I love these. Those are fun. Oh, look at that. Gorgeous. Look at these. There's some flower stamens. Love my gosh, that butterfly. And pretty little appliques. Oh, I love the bow. Oh my gosh, that's so gorgeous. These little flowers. Lots of little hearts and... Oh, let's see what that is. Is it like a deer? Something so cute. And then this one. It's like an angel. So pretty, Esme. I think that little bow might went in there and then there. And then here are some little ballerinas. So if you want to do like a 3D project, those would be cute. And then here's some more buttons. I think they were over here. I love this box so much. She told me she got it at Hobby Lobby. So I definitely want to go and grab me one of these. They're so cute. I don't want to break up her little arms and legs. And then OMG, look at these. Lots of sparkle. I love these flowers. Oh my gosh, they're beautiful. And these are little pens. Oh, look how gorgeous those are. Beautiful. Wow. Esme, so gorgeous. Okay, and then in this little container here, there's some beautiful trims. Aren't they gorgeous? I love those. They look so pretty in there. And oh my gosh, you guys, look at these gorgeous beaded trims. Oh my 
my goodness. Let me show you one at a time. So I think this goes like this, or you could have it the other way. But oh, that is beautiful. Let's do this one. And look at this one. So pretty. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh my gosh. So yeah, these go in here and they are just fabulous. So that is the entry from Esme and that will be going to Violet. Next up I have the Vintage Goose. Her name is Melissa. Thank you so much for labeling those. That really helps me. <laughs> I love how she decorated the box. Let me see if I can cover up the address. So her little labels, aren't they cute? So pretty. Thank you, Melissa. So this is for Violet and this is for Violet. And then this was the gorgeous card she made for, let's see, for Violet. Isn't that gorgeous? I love the swan on there. So pretty. It's gorgeous. And then this is the embellishment box. And I'm going to go ahead and open it because I know that um, you guys are going to want to see that. So she just put the tiniest little sticker there so I'm able to open it without ruining the paper and here is her embellishment box it's so cute oh my gosh I love it I have been wanting to see her work in person for so long <laughs> I love it it's so cute I love the little jemmies here and the flowers and the pom-pom trim and her famous paper ruffle and this beautiful little trim in the back. And then on the inside, she used one of the embellishment boxes that I showed in my video that I picked up at Dollar Tree. And this is gorgeous. So over here, she has some cute little ruffled trim. It's so cute. It's like a little cotton trim. And then there's some pretty paper flowers and millinery flowers. So cute. Oh, and I see something else underneath there. Oh, I wonder if these are her mom's little crocheted flowers. Aren't they so cute? Oh, I love them. So those flowers and the millinery flowers go back in there. And then over here she has, oh my gosh, the cutest little um, what do you call that? Oh, I love the heart too. And look at that. She has some flat backs here. Oh, I love those colors. Look how pretty. Pale pink and white. And some appliques. And I think I'm knocked something over here. Yeah. The little bow. Oh my gosh, they're so cute little bows and a pink bow shoot a lot in that little corner there that little compartment okay and then oh yeah all her beads
Wow, look at those beads. How fun are those? Yum. Love those. Oops. And look at these. Oh my gosh, the tiniest little bead dangles. All of these are wire wrapped. Oh my gosh, girl. That is amazing. So fun. And bows, you know I love the bows. Sorry. <laughs> Look at all these cute little die cut bows with the tiniest little diamond dots in there. Oh my gosh. Wow. These are adorbs. Aren't they so cute? All right, let's put those in there. And then she has some tiny, oh my goodness, little sequin clusters. And then little die cuts, like little printable die cut. Oh my gosh, they're so tiny. Gorgeous. So cute, I love the deer. So cute. Let's see what these are. Oh my gosh, I love these. OMG, look at how cute these little words are. And then she has some without the words. With little, oh my gosh, that is the cutest thing ever. I love those. Oh, they're so cute. And she put this tape on the back and sewed these. Goodness, girl. I'll tell you that this, I believe, is one of Violet's favorite words. So she is going to love those. And then those two little, cute little pink pom-pom beads. Love those. Okay, now if I could get it back in the same way she did it. So cute. And then look at these teeny tiny little, oh my goodness, they're so cute, these little tassels. <laughs> oh my gosh, Melissa, these are so freaking cute. Look at these tiny little clothespins. Oh my gosh. Okay, look how cute this is. Oh my goodness. Little, a tiny little rosette and then little flowers. I love the colors. You did so good. <laughs> cute little heart. And oh my gosh, I don't want to disturb this trim, so I'm going to leave it right there. But you see that sparkly mint trim and little pom-pom trim. Adorbs. And the mint. Oh my gosh, you got the mint in there too. And look at this cute little OMG. This little tiny container with the little flat back on top. She tied some cute little twine on there. And she fit all of these little rhinestone bits in here. Oh my gosh. OMG, these are gorgeous. Boy, this is dreamy. 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 <laughs> and she's got another container of these adorable little bows the tiniest little bow oh my gosh they're so cute and then the resin little bow love that and then pink ones so she did mint cream and pink 
Oh my gosh, look at that. That is a lot of die cutting. And putting those little tiny little dots on there. So stinking cute. Thank you, Melissa. That is adorable. And she said she has a little gift for me. I'm going to open it. You guys know you do not need to create me anything. But I am so very grateful. Oh, look how cute. Oh, my goodness. My son is, um, if you can hear him, he's singing. And uh, he's right next to my my craft room is his bedroom and he has um the radio not the radio but like his little kids bop cds and he is singing <laughs> he's so funny so if you hear that okay let's go ahead and open this i think this is like a hidden paper clip look at that cute little bunny so cute i love this pink polka dot bag that. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Look at, she decorated like a library pocket. Oh my gosh. There's one of those words. And she's got little flags here and she sewed it all with gold stitching. And in this little pocket, oh! <laughs> I'm so happy. I love these little bows and I love these velvet. Oh my gosh, these velvet leaves and that gorgeous little, uh, I know, I wonder if your mom, did your mom crochet that? And look at the tiniest little, those were those sequin clusters. Oh my gosh. And this cute little trim. I bet you I could take it off. So adorable. And let's see what else she's got in here. Oh my gosh. She gave me one of the little clips. So cute. And in here is a little bunny in a pocket. Oh, that is so cute. I really wanted that um, bunny stamp. But when I went to get it, it was sold out. I'm sure it's back in stock now. That was um, Obsession. Ob wait. Oh, I'll leave the information below. I can't remember. And I think this is an In Love Arts die up here. A little bag topper. Oh my gosh. Let me open this. So cute. Oh, she gave me some bunnies. They are so precious. Oh my gosh. So Jill Norwood did these um, these bunnies for Easter, stamped them out. Oh my gosh, that is gorgeous. Really, really cute. Oh my gosh, I love them. Thank you. And I love the little pocket. I think that's another In Love Arts um, die. There we go. And then in here is a little tag with a pink crochet doily. Look how cute that is. Adorable. I love it so much. It is so cute. What a sweet little gift that is. Oh, and then, um, oh, that's so cute. It's a uh, sticky, sticky note or a list pad. I love lists and these cute little page flags. Good things come in small packages. That's so cute. And then here is her information. Go check her out. Show her some love. I love this little card that she has so cute thank you so much and look at her little sticker on the back isn't that adorable thank you so much melissa for your entries i will have one for your vr on um, or your instagram post and your vr 
and then for your entry here. So you'll get three entries. So thank you so much. I will talk to you guys real soon. Bye for now.